I will come back to you. How? Through the Holy Spirit. This is why Paul in Romans 13 says, and do this knowing the time, that now it's high time to awake out of our sleep. For our salvation is nearer. Why is our salvation? Our deliverance is even nearer than when we first believe or receive. Why? Because Christ has taken up residence in the inside. So he's closer to us now than he was when he was just walking in the physical flesh. Let me open this up. I've taught this before, this word, but this word was so thin here, I just had to put it again. I didn't put all the words up. Donna Lawrence said this, and you've heard it before, but it's, 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 it just fits right here for the point that I'm making. Look what he says in this song he wrote, he wrote There's a, there is a king in you. Yeah. Right? Look, well, look what he says. There is a king in you. You come from royalty. Talking about the born again believer. Yes, sir. So, so you are royalty. The world we just read cannot receive me. But you, and the result of that, there's a king in you, he said, you come from royalty, an aristocratic dynasty. Oh, look, 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 look at it, look at it. But the goal of the enemy. Now, let me pause. And even religion, if it's not used in the right way, serve the same purpose. The goal of the enemy is to keep you from knowing who you are. Now, this is not to bash nobody because I'm not that, that way. But in the shaping of some of the catechism doctrines of the Catholic Church, they were afraid of the spirit. They were afraid of anything that they could not control. They didn't want the people to seek the spirit because they couldn't control that. It was unpredictable. So they wrote catechism, even for the priest, everything that he has the prayers that he prayed are already written down and he has to read them. They don't want him to become spiritual. Just save what you read so you can teach him to read with no feelings. Because you don't want to spur that spirit because of that spirit gets spot. Something will happen that will cause me to put this paper down and I'll start to tap into this power. So to shut that down, don't pray from inspiration. Read what we put before you. It's control. Okay, let me finish reading this because uh, I'm gonna be out. Uh, I said, okay. So he said, the goal of the enemy is to keep you from knowing who you are. That's power when you speak. Be mindful of the words you release. You were born to rule. The king in me come to say to the king in you that you have a king in you. Then he says, Embrace your king. Let the king rejoice. Let your past go. There's a ruler in you, a God in you. So rule, rule, or rule. Speak, king, speak. Stand, king, stand. You'll never be happy living beneath who you are. 